Hi everyone, and welcome back to the series From Ashes to a New Beginning, written by yours truly, Stacey Holt. Artwork was by Pastel Kitty Gore Art on Instagram, otherwise known as Maddie Kitty 1997 on Devian Art. I'll leave her links below. I highly recommend you go check out her artwork. I will also leave everyone that is collaborating within this chapter, which are Adrian and Cat Noir will be voiced by Shane, I will be voicing Marinette, Ladybug, and the narrator, and Anna will be voicing Chloe. If you'd like to support the channel, you can like, subscribe, and comment. Now. Now. Chapter 13. Her Studio. Alright, so this is your studio, Chloe said, opening a door. Marinette stepped into a room that had barely anything inside of it. It had a built-in table that was connected to the wall that had cabinets above them with a sink. There were huge windows across from them to provide natural light, which was a nice touch. Uh, where is all the furniture? Marinette asked. You have to provide that yourself. This isn't a charity event. Chloe rolled her eyes, walking away. Chloe? Marinette called out, turning around. <sighs> what is it, Miss Dupain Chang? She said, sighing. I know we weren't the best friends in high school, but I hope we can be better colleagues here. Marinette smiled. Sure. Chloe said, a little weary of Marinette's motives, and walked back into the hallway, and left Marinette in her studio alone. Marinette walked into her studio, shutting the door behind her and started taking pictures on her phone. Marinette sat on the cold concrete and started to use her finger on her phone to draw, but looked up when she heard a knock on her studio door about 20 minutes later. Come in, she called. Adrian walked in and smiled. So you did find your studio room, he said looking around. What do you think of the space? It's roomy, she said politely, not sure what else to say. What are you doing sitting on the ground? He asked confused. Uh, well, I took pictures of the room and was sketching where I was going to put stuff once I bought stuff to put in here. She smiled awkwardly. I, I'm so sorry. I completely forgot you didn't have any money. I'll help you go shopping. Adrian apologized. No, it's alright. You've already helped enough. You helped me get this job. She said. How about this then? I'll pay for whatever you want, and you can just pay me back later. He offered. Marinette thought for a moment, but then nodded, thinking she wouldn't be able to work without the equipment and utensils to work with anyhow. Deal. She smiled. Good. We can go shopping now. We're only part-time, after all. You can't really start until you have everything to start working. He laughed. Don't you have to work today? She asked. I've already turned in all the paperwork that I need to do today, so I'm good for the day. Also, helping a new employee get everything they need to do the best they can technically counts as me doing my job. He laughed, causing Marinette to laugh back. <laughs> all right then, she said. Come on, let's go, he said, opening the door for her to leave. Marinette brushed her clothes off and walked out of her studio. The day was long, but Adrian and Marinette still had fun shopping for her new studio, as he helped her pick things out. He showed her new things to put in there that he learned from being at the design studio for that year and a half. They loaded up as much as they could and put it into his car when Marinette remembered the most important part that she just needed in her studio. What? Adrian asked. A sewing machine, Marinette sighed. I thought I would have one, but mine burned in the fire, she frowned. Don't worry, we can pick you one up tomorrow. Adrian smiled. Adrian drove home and Marinette stepped out of the car, both tired from the long day. I'm gonna go take a bath, Marinette groaned. Alright, I'm going to go eat some dinner. Adrian smiled, still fiddling in the car as he watched Marinette disappear in the house. As soon as Marinette disappeared into the house, he lifted his jacket pocket and looked down at Plague, who rolled his eyes. Plague, claws out. Adrian smirked. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, you can go check out some of my other videos like Thunderstorm, which is Season 1, Downpour, which is Season 2 of Thunderstorms, The Butterfly That Brought Us Together, and so on. 
But for now, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys! <laughs>